Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, Bearcat U. I hope you're doing well. It's your instructor, Jacob Spradling, coming to you uh, with another rat core class wrap uh, with, uh, with me. And uh, again, I hope you're doing well. I wanted to start off this particular wrap by reminding you that we were obviously off on Monday for Labor Day, but I'd already spoken to you with a previous announcement as well as some other things about how the certain things we need to have done before we come to class tomorrow, Wednesday. But we'll talk about those again here. So, uh, first of all, I wanted to make sure we look at our announcements, uh, that, that I, the one that I sent out last week, specifically classroom change. Uh, you will see here uh, our room change. We finally get a cooler room. And by cool, of course, I mean the temperature. Uh, that uh, I have not been inside it, so I cannot actually validate how cool the room might be, but uh, hopefully the temperature actually is, is nice. So we're gonna be in AB4305. Remember, AB4 is just across that little uh, 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 street, right where uh, in between, um, uh, where you come from Bearcat Plaza straight out like you're going towards the, the Raven statue, that street right there. And AB4 is just across from CHSS. So we're going to be in room 305 of AB4. Um, uh, that's where we're going to meet. Remember that for uh, tomorrow's class, you need to make sure to watch those two videos in lesson two and complete the quiz. And what I mean by those two videos is if you go into your course, and I'm going to just turn on my student preview really quick. Uh, if you go into your course and get access to uh, the course, you will actually be able to go into lesson two and see uh, the, the Labor Day online content due by Wednesday and then the time management quiz. So if I look here at this one and go into this, you will see where you can find how we're, what, we're, what you're supposed to be listening to and watching, right? The video is about time management. So obviously right here, uh, the time management, it's really just a recording of a slide deck it's a video in that it's all put together as a video, but please watch it. This is actually one of the secrets to success of college life in general, and believe it or not, your work life after. Uh, but being able to take a look and see how time management works, uh, go through the PowerPoint presentation, and then take the quiz uh, when you're done uh, so that, that you can get, um, this, we, essentially we can make sure that you're involved and engaged. Um, one of the things that we're going to be doing this week in class, Wednesday, with Michaela, is you'll be working through uh, doing um, a master calendar. And in this regard, it's only going to be done within, uh, a, a, we want you to submit it via a Word file. Uh, and you'll see uh, there in the course the file that we have you attach or, or download and get access to. But I say that to tell you that, for instance, remember, if you're having trouble figuring out, well, I don't know how to upload a Word file, Jacob. Uh, there's a there's a module right up here called Microsoft 365. Oop, it's empty. It's uh, I guess the content was moved, so that's okay. I will unmove it. But if you have any questions, you can actually go to um, uh, uh, Office's website, right? The uh, SHSU's Office website. So how do I do that? You might be asking yourself. Well, for instance, I could actually call go to Live 365 um, com, which is a Microsoft property. And, uh, uh, oh, that's not it. That's actually a broadcast studio. <laughs> and this is where uh, 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 showing people things live can be problematic. So if I go to uh, Microsoft uh, 365 and just Google that, right? It'll take me to Microsoft 365 login. From there, I can actually open up, um, uh, I, can, I can sign in and get access to it by clicking on sign in it'll prompt me to insert my email address. And you just put your university email address in it, and it will take you directly to uh, Microsoft where you can get access to opening up Word files and PowerPoint files and all that good stuff that can help you. If you have any questions about that, remember you can always call the service desk at 294-HELP or 294-1950. Either one of those will work just fine. But uh, just so you know, that's where you can find uh, how to open up um, uh, um, those those Microsoft files, right? So, anyway, getting back to the getting back to the course. So, I'm going back into the course. Bear with me. Uh, so that being said, um, uh, when you're in the course, you'll see that uh, going into the time management section, uh, you have to get that quiz completed. The time management quiz completed by uh, uh, the due date is actually uh, tomorrow. 
uh, by 11.59, so it needs to be done, but uh, we would rather you get it done before, so you, we, you can talk a little bit more uh, about time management with Michaela tomorrow. Uh, so the, the organizing time, which is what you'll be doing in a live session uh, in class, you're gonna be doing with Michaela, and there's some really important stuff that you guys are gonna talk about. Uh, one of the things that, that I, I'll say about this is that I organize my time uh, using the Outlook calendar. So um, for the school, in, in, in our previous, um, in our, uh, in the module here under um, the online uh, content due by Wednesday, the Labor Day holiday, we actually, if I were to scroll down to the bottom, uh, you've got some resources down here at the bottom, uh, at, all the way at the bottom on, uh, you know, figuring out the kinds of, uh, um, tools to use. In this case, we've got a resource on the Outlook calendar and a resource in the Google calendar. And the Outlook calendar is good because it works right with the school. It's the school's email address. So it might be a good place to just have all your school content. And then what I do is I actually connect my phone to my university Outlook calendar. And that way I always, I always have my due dates, you know, right there with me so I know what's going on. Uh, my personal stuff I use a Google calendar for. So I actually use both of them, strangely enough. But anyway, so, uh, that is um, uh, uh, some information for you there. But for what you'll be doing in class, it uh, is starting to work on getting that master calendar put together. And in this case, uh, you'll be talking about that with Michaela, but just as, as a tip, because I've already gotten a couple emails about this, is that the um, master calendar is right here. You can actually download the file to your computer and start working on it. You can use Office 365 and open it. Um, uh, all that good stuff, uh, but uh, you can you can download it. You can add to it following the instructions in right here in the activity, and then upload it when it comes time for your journal activity. Right, the 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 journal master calendar. So um, uh, beyond that, uh, the other activity that we have for this week is the common reader corner discussion, and this is for some bonus points. Um, uh, so there's instructions in here. Bonus points are always good, especially when you know you might be right on the edge between a, most of y'all I know it's gonna be between a B and an A, but those are always good to have in your back pocket. And the common reader is phenomenal uh, for some nuggets of wisdom for you. As always, if you have any questions for this week, let me know, but for sure, remember we wanna have the, the quiz done for the time management section and read through that presentation before you get to class on Wednesday. Uh, and then you'll be working on that master calendar, which will be due Wednesday evening um, uh, as well. So that being said, I hope you are well. I hope you have a great rest of your day, and we look forward to seeing you soon.